Hello everyone. This video is about pronouns. In this video, let us learn about the kinds of pronouns with the help of some examples. Before I start the video, I request all to subscribe my channel. If you wish to watch my previous videos, you can watch them clicking on the links given in the description box. Let us learn what a pronoun means. A pronoun is used as a substitute for a noun or a noun phrase. It can function as a subject, object, complement in a sentence. A pronoun is also used to avoid the repetition of nouns or noun phrases. In this slide, you can see the kinds of pronoun. Let me read the pronouns for you all. Personal pronoun, possessive pronoun, reciprocal pronoun, demonstrative pronoun, reflective pronoun, relative pronoun, interrogative pronoun, indefinite pronoun. Let us learn about personal pronouns. I, we, you, they, he, she, it are personal pronouns. Personal pronouns are either the subject of a sentence or an object within a sentence. On the basis of their function in a sentence, these personal pronouns are divided into three. That is, first person, second person and third person. Let us learn more about personal pronouns. First person singular, I. First person plural, we. Second person singular and plural, you. Third person singular, he, she, it. Third person plural, they. Let us learn about personal pronouns more clearly with the help of some examples. Let me read the examples for you all. I have eaten an apple. We wear masks. In these two sentences, the pronoun I is the first person singular, whereas V is the first person plural pronoun. Third one, you should sanitize your hands frequently. In this sentence, the pronoun you stands for second person singular and plural pronoun. Fourth one, he is taking all precautions. Fifth one, she took the advice of the doctor. Sixth one, it barked at the strangers. In these sentences, he, she, it are the third person singular pronouns. Seventh one, they are injecting the vaccine to the patients. In this sentence, the pronoun they is the third person plural pronoun. Possessive pronouns. My, mine, our, ours, your, yours, his, her, hers, its, theirs, their are the possessive pronouns. Possessive pronouns indicate possession of something. Let us try to understand possessive pronouns more clearly with the help of some examples. Let me read the examples for you all. I like my house. We should use our mask. You should take your tickets. He must pay his fee. She cleans her house. It takes its medicines. They will submit their project tomorrow. In these sentences, my, our, your, his, her, its, their are the possessive pronouns. Reciprocal pronoun. Pronouns which denote mutual actions or reciproc the same action are called reciprocal pronouns. Examples. Children can help each other in doing their homework. All the students should help one another. In these two examples, each other and one another are the reciprocal pronouns. Demonstrative pronouns. This, that, these, those are the demonstrative pronouns. They are used to point out the objects to which they refer. Examples. This is my book. These are my books. That is your cap. Those are your pens. In these examples, this, these, that and those are the demonstrative pronouns. Reflective pronouns. Myself, ourselves, yourselves, yourself, himself herself and themselves are the reflective pronouns. The pronouns are so called because the action done by the subject turns back upon the subject. Examples. I enjoyed myself very much. They saw themselves in the mirror. You have done it yourself. He hit himself. She taught herself the grammar. In these examples, myself, themselves, yourself, himself and herself are the reflective pronouns. Relative pronouns. Who, whom, whose, which, that are relative pronouns. They join the sentences and refer back to nouns going before them. Examples. This is the building which I built. I don't know who spoiled the book. In these two examples, which 
and who are the relative pronouns interrogative pronouns who what which whose whom are the interrogative pronouns they are used for asking questions examples who is disturbing the class what is your name which place is worth visiting during summer whose books are lying on the ground whom are you scolding in these sentences who what which whose whom are the interrogative pronouns indefinite pronouns indefinite pronouns refer to persons or things in a general way examples one should love oneself each of you should attend the function can someone help me in solving mathematics problems either of the books is good neither of the boys did the homework in these sentences one each someone either neither are the indefinite pronouns here are a list of indefinite pronouns let me read the list for you all each every all much more most many little less least few several enough one someone somebody something anyone anybody anything either neither no no one nobody none nothing I hope you have all understood a pronoun and kinds of pronoun. Here is an activity for you all. Look at the picture and make sentences using the different kinds of pronouns. Do like, share and subscribe my channel and also hit the bell icon because whenever I upload a new video you will get a notification. All my previous videos links are given in the description box. You can click on the links and watch my videos.